This is going to be 66th Street South in St. Petersburg. This is a pre-purchase inspection. I am on what looks like an, the add-on part of the house. So if you're staring at where the driveway is off of 66th Street, I am on the right-hand side on the roof. This is definitely going to be a PVC section here. That looks just like some shavings for PVC. Now we're into cast iron. And I believe we're upside down. Yep, so this is going to be a combo. Made it through there. Looks to be pretty scaly on the bottom, but nothing too absurd. That's definitely going to be some cast iron scaling here. Currently under some water. With the scaling, is uh, it's not good to have scaling in a line because what happens is the toilet paper and such is just going to get caught up on it. If I'm not mistaken, it looks like we got some roots in the line here. Yep. I'm going to keep pushing forward first before I start mapping out where the problems are. It's getting a little difficult to see here. Uh, the camera's a little blurry. Time and date stamps on the top left. The counter's on the bottom. This appears to be where the city tap is. I'm going to try to use this to clear my head off. Yep. So this is the city tap. So this is potentially going to be clay. It's hard to get a crystal clear view of the problem. But I'm going to pull back slow because I have a pretty good trained eye with seeing if there's any real issues. I'm going to go around the house to see if I can find a hose bib and kind of flush out the line. Okay, so got the water running on the inside of the house. This is going to be the shower in the master bathroom. So that way we can take a better look of what's going on here. So we can see right here, this is where the roots start. You can kind of see the little white lightning bolts over here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to switch my battery out and locate it. Uh, so we're going to lose this part of the video. Okay, so where I've marked this is going to be a palm tree right before a telephone pole or a power pole. And this is right next to the alley. It's uh, about three and a half feet deep. It's pretty deep. We're going to see if we could uh, pull back and see. We can see it's uh, holding some water here. And it is holding water because of the roots that are just right there. So this is, this is definitely outside the house. That's going to be the drop. I 
I know the camera's a little blurry. It's kind of hard to run water at the same time and keep my camera lens all beautiful and clear. But it's just that one section so far. And there's definitely some cast iron debris in the bottom of the pipe, but not a lot. A little bit of debris there as far as toilet paper. Now, I ran the shower for, for some good time here, so uh, if there was going to be an issue, it would have backed up. With this line being cast iron, I would definitely not use like what, what you're seeing in front of us now. That's definitely going to be some toilet paper. So we're, pulling, we're about to pull up into the PVC line. So we all know this is perfect. This is the add-on part of the house. There's one stack all the way to the right-hand side of the house. If you're standing at the driveway, I'm going to go from that one. That's the original part. So I'm really concerned about that. So hopefully that turns out good. All right, so right now we're running down the stack of the original 4-inch stack of the house. And right here is the base. We're going to zero it out. As far as the original part of the house, everything looks to be in pretty decent shape. See this toilet paper there. You just have to be super mindful of what kind of toilet paper you use here. Charmin, Angel Soft, Cottonelle are toilet papers you need to stay away from. No matter how new the pipe is, it's just going to get caught up in a lot of pipes. I know right now with the coronavirus going around, everyone's just trying to get whatever toilet paper they can get. You can see the pipe on the bottom, just a little bit of scaling, but nothing terrible here. That would be a little major scaling on the bottom of the pipe. This house could use some uh, hydro jetting in some areas. You can see that's going to be original test tee that's above us. So we ought to be getting close to where everything exits the house. At least the original part of the house. And we've already gone down this part, so we're good to go. This will conclude the video. Thanks for watching.